Hey friends, Fearless Fame here. Welcome back to my channel. And I'm going to come to you with a small Ulta haul. As you know, I haven't done any shopping since I've been here in Valdosta. Um, except for pick up that Maybelline Nudes palette from Target a couple of weeks ago. And your girl has been dying, okay? Running my own business. Money don't flow the way it flow when you're getting a uh, constant check. But I had to go do something. So they just opened an Ulta here. They had the grand opening last weekend. So I'm going to show you what I got. First of all, I picked up this Lorac lipstick. It's an Alter Ego lipstick in Nymph. And I was really happy when I got in the car because I checked my uh, lipstick book, lipstick lip gloss book that I have where I record all my lipsticks. And this is my first Lorac lipstick. Of course, it's a pale pink because that's what I like. Really pretty pink. Very pigmented. So this is my first Lorac lipstick and it is in Nymph. I don't know if that's going to focus for you, but it is by the Alter Ego Collection. I'm not even sure if this is a new collection or not. I just basically was walking around Ulta and I said, okay, I want to stay around $50 and I just want to get my retail therapy on without feeling guilty afterwards. And I saw this color and I just could not leave it there. So that's what I picked up. The second thing I picked up, if you guys have heard of it, comment below because I have never heard of this. This is an Urban Decay Bondage Makeup Adhesive. It is for glitters. So you guys know I like to wear my glitters and stuff like that. And I don't remember how much this was because receipts in my purse. I think this was like 12 or something. The lipstick was 20 something, of course, Lorac. And this is Urban Decay Bondage. And it looks like this. And it's supposed to keep your glitter and I will definitely do a review this week it's supposed to be put a little bit on um, it's not supposed to get sticky or gummy or gooey according to the box which is what made me want to try it lay on the glitter crystals our lightweight water-based formula holds it in place never feels sticky or gummy and stays put until you take it off using only water if you've tried it, if you have it, let me know. I will do a review on it. I am keeping my receipt in case it doesn't live up to par. And the last thing I picked up, which I walked by like 10 times, I was on the fence. It took me $10 over my budget. My total came out to $60. I picked up the Naked Flushed Palette. And this gives you a bronzer, highlighter, and blush. This is in strip flushed because there are um, about four I want to say four of these and I had to do an eeny meeny miny mo because they were all gorgeous but I picked the one with the most glitter this one in this color right here which I guess is the highlighter had the most glitter and this is in strip and it's the bronzer highlighter and blush like I said there are like four or five of these you can go on Ulta's website or Urban Decay's website and this is naked flush and I don't own this and this was um i think like 30 dollars yeah this was 30 and i think the other two were like 15 which took me to 60 dollars so and i wanted to spend 50 but i'm okay i'm gonna try this out probably tomorrow so follow me on instagram because my face of the day will be with all three of these so i'm gonna keep the box in case i want to take it back but it says this bronzy naked trio features super silky bronzer highlighter and blush use them individually or blend them all together bask in the radiant afterglow and like i said check the website there were like four or five or five of these but this is strip okay and it looks like this really cute packaging and that is all i picked up today i did really good ten dollars over my budget i think i've handled my little urge my little craving for a minute at least so yes and i want to say thank you to all of you who supported me in the business that I'm opening you commented you supported those of you who want to support information is on the video there are items that I can ship out to you if you want to support or buy something um, check the Instagram page for my business it is apparel um, the letter N beauty check it out I also have a Facebook page beauty needs in more the letter N um, or just email me and I can send you pictures of certain things that I'm able to ship out and I appreciate it 
thank you so much remember makeup is not one size fits all and i'll see you the next time we plan our makeup